Hello. In this video, I will be demonstrating how to terminate a SamTom ST connector to 900 micron fiber. First, turn your splicer on. Next, check that your parameters are correct. In this case, I am connectorizing to a single mode fiber, SamTom connector, utilizing 900 micron. So my settings are correct. Then, open your connector. Remove your large tube. This is just a protector, it's trash. Take your back boot, place on your 900 micron fiber. Install your bayonet. Thread it onto your fiber and then your shrink sleeve. Now load your fiber into your 900 micron holder, placing the fiber in the center channel, leaving one inch tail from the front. Turn your stripper on and open your left then right stripper doors. Place your holder, pushing it all the way forward and closing both of your doors. Then open your left door, remove your holder, take your cleaning wipe, load with alcohol, and clean your fiber. Then open your right door, remove your trash, Open your cleaver door till it's fully engaged. Then your trash bin. Place your holder in the channel, making sure it's pushed fully forward. Close your trash bin, close your cleaver door, and depress the button. Again, opening your cleaver door till it's fully engaged, remove your holder, and place in your splicer. Next, take your connector Holder, open your door and place your connector inside. Close your door. It should close freely. Then place in the stripper, closing both your doors. Remove your holder. Clean your fiber. Then open your right door, remove your trash, opening your trash bin, placing your holder in the channel, close your trash bin, close your cleaver door, press your button, fully engage again, remove your holder, and place in your splicer. At this point, close your wind cover, wait for your fiber to align, once it's paused and you're happy with your left and right cleave angles, press play to complete the splice. Once the arc is complete, you're happy with everything, open your wind cover, allowing the tensile test to be performed. Once it comes back to your ready screen, you can fully open your wind cover then open your left door, then your connector door. Remove your connector and allow it to hang freely. Then taking your heat shrink and bringing all the way to the back of the connector. Place your connector within the oven, close both your doors, then turn your oven on. At this point, close both of your holder doors and close your wind cover. Once your oven has turned off, open your oven and place your connector in the cooling tray, allowing it to cool for at least 10 seconds. Once complete, 
bring your bayonet to the top. And then your back boot, firmly pressing the two together. This completes this video. Thank you.